Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Rosie and today is a little bit different or a lot of bit different <laughs> from my normal videos. Today I'm doing a Brumley try on haul and like going over the clothes and giving you guys my honest opinions about it because why does it look my face look? because I honestly needed to get new clothes and then I was like Romway is really cheap I might do a sheen haul in the future because I also got that app and like looked through everything and they have a bunch of cute clothes too so you're gonna get my first impressions of opening this box because I literally got this huge box in I don't know if it has everything in it <laughs> I think I got 18 or 19 items and I got a bunch of pants mostly and then a couple of cute shirts and stuff I haven't even opened it, it just says Bromley, so I was like, okay, you might as well just see my true reaction, which is what you're gonna get, because I haven't even seen anything in it yet. I ended up spending around $200 on this, so we have a lot to go over today. It was like $190 something, and um, I got like 20 items, so I figured that was good. My mom like did the math, it was like $12 an item, so it was kind of worth it, it just depends on the quality now. So I'm gonna open each thing, review over it, and then I'm gonna try it on and show you a clip of that. <sighs> I'm scared. Can we just talk about how they package this up? Is that all really necessary? Down. Ooh, ooh, I think it is everything. They really packed it in nicely. Shout out to whoever packed this up. You did a good job. Okay, I'm gonna pull out each little bag. Wait a dang minute. Wait a dang minute. I ordered all of these from Brumway, but that says Sheen. What? These two say Sheen. This one says Brumway. Are they like affiliated? Are they like the same? Somebody please explain because right now I'm opening a Brumway box and everything says Sheen. <laughs> they packed this up. They packed it up hard, like, they really shoved everything in here. <laughs> okay, so half of the stuff says Sheen on it, which I'm very confused about. When I ordered everything, the shipping was free, and it was express shipping, and it said it wasn't going to come in until, like, July something, so I was like, uh, I was, like, not expecting this to come in quick. But this came in after, like, a week. Let's just get right into opening these up. So this one says Sheen on it. <laughs> and it looks like they just all these have like little zipper bags. Super easy to open. Uh, they feel damp. Like they feel wet. <laughs> Maybe it's because it's like humid outside. They literally feel like wet though. They feel like somebody just took them out of the dryer and they're like not fully dry. Don't know. Anyway, the material feels thin, but like not like it's going to like rip. Like it feels fine. I got these in a medium just because I have like pretty big thighs and I don't want them to be too small. It looks pretty good from right here. They look a little bit wrinkly, but maybe it's just because they're not on anything. So we're going to see when I try them on. The waistband looks pretty good. Like it looks like um, it's very elastic, which I like instead of like a zipper. Same thing with these bottoms. It also came with this belt, which is super cute, except I don't really know how it goes. It's like a little... It's one of these clip things, which I think looks cool. Here's what these look like on the website. And these were $13.95. They looked really cute online, which is why I wanted to buy them. And here they are on. They fit pretty well. The only thing wrong with them was in the front, they kind of poof out a little bit. The waistband is very stretchy and elastic, so you can sit them wherever you'd like. They also have these cute little pockets, which are so cute. I forgot to put on the belt, though. I'm so sorry. I completely forgot about it. But I think overall, for the price that they are, they are very worth it. The material is a little bit uncomfortable, but for the most part, it's okay. So overall, these are good. Okay, uh, it's another sheen bag. We're gonna see what this one is. So these are these really cool, like, reflective pants. You can't tell unless I shine a light on them. But, um, they're so- oh my god, they look so trippy in person. I don't know if you can tell. I'll show you these with a the light on because they're supposed to be reflective, which I thought was really cool. Here are these with the flash on. They are very <laughs> reflective, as you can see. I think they look so dope. So I actually really like how these look. Here's what they look like on the website. 
These were $16.95, which again is a pretty good price for what they are. And first impressions. I don't know how long I can stare at this because it's like trippy. It looks so weird in person. It's like tripping me out, but I do really like it. I think it's really cool. They do look super crinkly, which I'm not really feeling, but I don't know what I would expect. The material once again is really thin, like super thin. Like that's all that there is. The only elastic is in the back of this waistband because the front has a built-in belt, which is, again, one of these cute little things, which I think are kind of cute. Um, once again, these have these little things on the bottom. They're pretty stretchy. It just feels like a rain jacket. Like, that's exactly what it feels like, which I feel like I would expect it to feel like that because of the material that it is and, like, the reflectiveness of it. It's like a windbreaker, kind of. Here's what they look like on, and let me tell you, I absolutely hated how these felt on me. Literally, when I did that, like, air would come out of them, and I guess it was, like, holding air. It was, like, sweaty. The material did not feel good. It just was not... I thought I looked stupid. It kind of looks weird. I don't know. I feel like you can make it work sometimes, but I definitely could not wear these, like, all day. Next package. This one is a shirt, and this one says runway. Oh, Oh, it's cute. It's a cute little tank top. Um, one thing that I did notice is that none of the sheen stuff have tags on them, but this runway one does. It's a little bit odd. It also doesn't say anything on it. It's just a tag that says runway, and then on the back it has their Instagram and, like, Facebook. Here's what this looked like on the website, and it was only $6.95. I got this in a size small. It's, like, stretchy, which I'm enjoying. Um, I feel like it is a little bit flimsy, like it could come apart right now. Also, this top tie is a little messed up, but I think it might just be because that's like, it was in packaging for so long. I think these cups are a little bit big for a small. The only thing wrong with this is that the cups are a little too big, but it might look okay on. So here's what it looks like on. This actually fit really well. I think it looks so cute. The only thing is the tie was a little bit flimsy and you can kind of see the padding on the cups. The only problem with that is that when you're in direct sunlight, it's going to be really noticeable, but I think normally it's pretty well and overall I really like this. Okay, next thing is another sheen thing. So we have these shorts. The material actually feels pretty nice. Here they are on the website. These were $7.95, which I actually feel like was a little bit much only because they have like softies at Walmart for like $2. They're kind of very big. <laughs> I got these in a medium because I don't want my butt hanging out of it. I was hoping maybe it would be better if I got a medium, but I might need a small. They look very big. The waist looks all right. It also has the tie, which I feel like adds in case I need to. It's very elastic, stretchy. Um, the color's cute. It looks a teeny bit see-through, especially on the pink side. Just a teeny bit. You can kind of see, like, yeah, just a little bit, but not too bad. The material is very thin, as with everything else. Like, you can see through it. It probably, like, this part's a little bit thicker, but it is kind of thin. Yeah, I'll give it to them. These are cute. <laughs> Here these are on. I actually think they are very cute on. The waist fits very nicely. I didn't even have to untie or retie them. I just kind of slipped them on and the waist like still clenches onto me. They are very elastic. They are soft. Um, they're just a teeny bit see-through, but nothing too bad. So overall, I think these are actually really cute. Next item is runway. Feels very thin. Here are these on the website. They were only $12.95, which is a super cheap price, so it makes sense that it's thin. I got these in a size medium, but they do look a bit small. The waist looks small because it's not very, like, elastic. It also has a button and a zipper and this cute little belt. Um... The material is very thin, but I feel like it's like windbreaker material again. It's not as thick as the reflective pants though, but it is kind of thin. Once again, it has these little scrunchy things at the bottom. These are cute. Here are these on. The only thing was that I literally cannot figure out how to use that belt. 
um anyway they do have a little bit of room but it's like a comfortable amount and they are a little bit stretchy which i was not expecting they're very comfortable i think they look really cute i could honestly wear these all day so overall i think they're so cute so i definitely recommend these This one's from Runway. It feels very heavy because I know that this shirt has a chain on it. Mmm, I like it already. Okay, so it looks like it's a Razorback with this chain. It doesn't look see-through. The material is kind of thin. It's not very stretchy, although it looks like it would be. But I'm kind of living for this. Like, it's kind of cute already. Like, wow. It's also clip off which I don't know why you would want to. <laughs> like, what are you gonna wear it? Like, I don't know. They clip off if you would like to. Here it is on the website. This shirt was $8.95, which I feel like is a pretty good price, especially because it is pretty good quality, especially with the chains and everything. I got this in a size small. It says that this is 100% polyester. Here it is on. I actually really, really like this one. It fits so well. It's like perfectly snug. It sits really well with where the chains are. It fits me so good. The back looks so cool. I honestly just really like it. It's probably like my favorite item that I got. And especially for the price, it is 100% worth it in my opinion. These are these pink tie-dye sweatpants. Here are these on the website. They were $15.95, which is a pretty good price for these pants. These, once again, are elastic. The material is thin. It looks a teeny bit see-through just on some of the white parts. But it is a thin material, but I kind of like it that way. I feel like they're, like, airy and cute. And a medium. And these are 95% polyester and 5% spandex. They have little jogger pants on the bottom. Everything feels nice. Here's what these look like on. These were so soft and the material was so loose. It felt so good to wear them. Like these were probably one of like the best comfiest options that I bought. You can tell that they're really big, but I also really like it that way. They have cute little pockets and then the little tie in the front. I think they look super cute and because they're like a little bit longer, it kind of cuffs over a lot on my leg and I actually really like that. This one's from Rumway. This is cute. This one looks cute. Um, the only thing is I feel like you know this is going to fray. Like once I wash it, I feel like I know it's going to start coming up. You can just feel that, like, what kind of texture it is. But for now, it's cute. Um, it is stretchy. The only thing is they look kind of short. Like, I feel like this is going to be very high up. Here it is on the website. It was $6.95, but I do feel like the chains look a little bit longer than they actually are in person. I got this in a size small. Here's the material thin, but it's just like a normal tank top. Here's what it looks like on. This was super cute, but I hate to say that I was right about the chains. They are way too short, and it kind of brings the shirt up way too much. If you can see it, how like high it goes up in my back, and it's just like holding really tight with my armpit, and it's just like not comfortable, so I don't think I could make it work every day. All right, this one is from Rumway. This is a cute little top that just says Angel. These straps feel a lot like longer than the other one. I don't know if you can tell. Um, this looks a little bit see-through. I feel like I was expecting that when I saw that it was like white. You can kind of tell that it's a little see-through, but it's okay. Maybe just if you wear like a nude bra under it. The material is very thin, but once again, it's kind of just like a normal tank top. I got this in a size small. Here's what it looks like on the website. This was $6.95 and it definitely looks more see-through in person than it does on the website. And here's what this looks like on. It is a little bit loose, but overall it fits pretty well. Because it's loose, it makes it a little bit more comfortable. It's definitely see-through, as you can see the tag on the one side. But besides that, the only other problem is that the front of it, I feel like, might start peeling a little bit once I wash it. Only because you can tell that it's like a print-on thing. But other than that, I think this is actually pretty cute. Okay, here's the next one. This one's from Runway. Ooh... This is cute. It's kind of similar to that purple shirt that I got. It's cute. The material is stretchy, very stretchy. Thin, but stretchy, so it's okay. This little stuff looks so cute. Here's this online. It was $6.95. I got 
this in a size small. And here's what this looks like on. I think it looks pretty cute. Once again, the bottom is a little bit loose like the last one. The back is cute, and I think the front little lace stuff is cute as well, except sometimes it doesn't match up with how my actual like cups go. But overall, I think this is cute. Ooh, I'm so excited about this next one. I kind of forgot about it. So this is a cute little top. It ties up in the back. I got this in a size small. The material is not stretchy, which I feel like you would expect because it's kind of this silky looking material. It is double layered, which I like. They didn't just put one layer. It looks like they put a little bit more effort through this one. Um, the ties look a little bit finagly, like they're like weirdly tied. It looks like a giant mask. Here this is on the website. It didn't come tied as it is on here. You see how the back is crossed by the shoulders. It didn't do that when it came in and I figured that out after the fact. Here's what it looks like on. I didn't know about the tying thing, so the shoulders and like the breast area was a little bit really like loose and it didn't fit as well as the bottom did, as you can see in the back here. I think it looks cute. The string was really long because I didn't know it was laced up the wrong way, but once I put it in the right way, it fits very nicely and the string looks all right. So this one was really cute and it looked just how it did on the website. Next, I got these pants. The material feels a little bit weird right now. It's like the outside of them feels like jean, like corduroy jean, but the inside feels like harsh sweatpantsy, but it feels a little bit rough. I got these in a medium. These are really cool. They're all these like color blocks. They have little pockets. Just the material feels a lot thicker. Like the band is very like hefty, like it's very hard. Here these are on the website. These were $18.95, which I feel like is a really good price because the material of this feels a lot heavier and more sturdy, and it just is a very, like, nice material compared to the other things. Here's what they look like on. I think these were so cute. They look just how they did on the website. I like the color block. They fit nicely. The band is really nice. It's nice and sturdy while it's also comfortable on the inside. The material is the only thing that's a little bit uncomfortable, but for the most part, I could wear these all day. And I would definitely recommend these to anybody that likes them. What? What's going on here? I was very weirded out at first. I feel like that's a weird way to do it, but I guess because it has a tie in the front. It's basically just like two little cutouts and then there's a tie in the middle and then it has this really cute see-through mesh material with these little like circles on it, I guess. Here's what this looks like online. It was $8.95 and it looks pretty similar online as it does in person. The only thing is the ties and because it's not on somebody, it's hard to see what it would look like on somebody because they just like laid it down on the table. The only thing that I feel like would be confusing is putting it on. So let's see what it looks like on. I actually really, really like this. The only thing is I don't know how practical it is and where I could really wear it. I think it looks very cute. It was kind of complicated to tie. I really had to pull the top really tight. And then the middle part was like complicated to tie because it got in the way of the frillies. But I think it looks really cute. These pants I was so excited for, okay. Wow. These are so cool. Look at they have faces all over them. I'm so excited. They're supposed to be like baggy and cuff here. The material does feel very thin, but it feels just like a windbreaker. And it doesn't like it's not gonna break. Like it's sturdy. It just feels thin. Um the inside has a lot of this like extra material. And it goes all the way down. They have this little cuff at the bottom, stretchy. I got these in a medium. Here's what they look like on the website. Here's what these look like online. They were $14.95 and I was absolutely obsessed with them the second that I saw them and I added them to my cart. I thought they would look so cool. And then here's what they look like on. They actually did live up to my expectations. They're very comfortable. They're just like normal sweatpants. They're super baggy. The waist fits nicely. I think they look so cool and they also go with the one shirt that I bought. So I'm actually really, really happy about this purchase and I really love these. These are super cool. These more, more of these sweatpants things, except they have like a chain on the side. They're just black sweatpants. They have these little pockets at the bottom, which is a cool little thing. I think it looks cool. The material isn't as sweatpantsy. It's still thin. It's like the same material as the skater ones, like the ones with the checkered belt. It also has the same button and zipper as them. I wonder if they're literally just the same thing. 
This has elastic in the back, but not in the front. And then this cute little chain hanging there. I got these in a medium. It feels like they only have one side of the material. Like it's only like one little slap of it instead of double-sided, if that makes sense. Like you can just tell. It does feel thin, but it's not see-through, I can tell. These pockets aren't actual pockets. They just open up to the inside. These pockets are just like going to show my knees. I mean, all right, that's cool. <laughs> Here these are on the website. They were $14.95. And they look just how they did on the website as they do in person. The only difference is that they aren't quite as baggy where like the ankle is. It doesn't bunch up that much. I might just have to pull it up more. But here's what they look like on. The waist fits pretty good. They have little um that little chain thing and the pockets are all cute. It fits pretty well. It's a little bit tight on my thighs, but that's just because I have big thighs and like a smaller waist. But overall, these fit nicely. There is some room because there's elastic in the back. So I would definitely recommend these to anybody that wants them. And then they have a little button and a zipper with the chain. The elastic in the back makes them a lot more comfortable. These are camo with this little chain again. They're stretchy at the waistband. They have these cool pockets. The material is hard to explain. Like, this part's stretchy. But this part is not stretchy at all. Like, it will not budge. And it's like one-sided material again. Here these are on the website. They were $17.95. They look the same as they do on the website in person, which is good. They fit very nicely. Here's what they look like on. The only thing is the material is a little uncomfortable. And they also don't have a zipper or a button. They just elastic band on. Okay, last package. This is a completely different material from the last one. I'm so excited for these. I mean, they look cool. The material is thin. It's once again, one layer of the material. Here these are on the website. They were $12.95. They looked pretty alike, except the bottoms seem a little bit more poofy on the website than they do in person. Here's what they look like on. These fit me so well. There is a little bit room on the waist, but it makes it more comfortable. They fit my thighs and my waist very nicely. The material is so comfortable. I think it looks cute. I really love these. These are like a 10 out of 10, and I would recommend them to anybody that wants them. Okay, so in conclusion, I would say it is worth it. I feel like most of the things are okay. They all look cute. There's a couple things that are a little iffy and like one thing that I hate, but besides that... I feel like it is worth it for the prices that they are. They are super cheap. And um, if you're on a budget, go ahead. Like, I feel like it's worth it. And I'm editing this a few days after getting all these clothes in. And I've had a chance to wear some of them. So here are some pics of me in a couple of the outfits. But I would definitely recommend. I actually really, really like them. And I'm going to be wearing them a lot. And if you guys want to see me wearing them more, you can go check out my Instagram. I've already posted a couple of pics in these outfits. But I will probably in the future post more. So definitely go check that out if you want to see these like in action. Um, but anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.